someone asks you about coming in as a fullback, is that, is that weird? Do you like it? Yeah, I mean, I was, you know, I was introduced to it earlier this week, and I was super pumped to do it. And whatever the coach has asked me to do, I, I mean, it was, a, it was, it was awesome just to be able to line up, not have to worry about snapping the ball, and just go full speed and whack someone. So I we haven't it. seen a fullback here in a while. When, when that play gets called, is there a reaction even among the huddle and among the team that like power? We yeah, like it? yeah. So like that goal line play that we scored on, you know, everyone was hype. Like, let's go, Brett. Like. Let's, let's do it like let's let, we're, we're pounding us in and in the back of our heads like we all knew that it was going to be a touchdown and then on the last three plays to get the first down we're we're all jacked up like we're, we're going to get this we're going to pound it right right down their throat and we got the first down so has it been tough to hear like questions about physicality regarding that sensitive line um <laughs> um a little bit I'm i sure mean you yeah, yeah, yeah. We for sure hear it, and um, you know that's something we we wanted to improve on was like our physicality, because um, obviously we weren't we weren't executing the past couple of weeks. And but I felt like tonight, like this week at practice, we were fiery. We we practiced physical. Um, you know that was something that was a big key for us this week was handling their slants and being physical about it. A couple a couple players have alluded to that that practice was different. Mm -hmm. um, why do you think? I mean, aside from just losing. Why do you think it was different this week? Uh, I just think you know, coming you know, coming off two losses on the road to two good teams, uh, we were just kind of like we, we we weren't to the Trojan standard, mm -hmm. and we you know we need to come out here. We're gonna get this win at home, protect the Coliseum, and we're gonna continue it going forward. Um, There's definitely like a shift in attitude, like like the, the the stuff we did the past two weeks were not okay. So let's change it, and we did it, and that that was the result of win. So. Just curious, in the moment leading up to Stanford, leading up to Texas, yeah. did you feel it? Did you feel a little bit, I don't know, flat? Um, Were you aware of it? Um, I mean, obviously our, our team prepared hard and we, we worked hard through the week. And, um, you know, obviously all of us thought, you know, we're going to come out here and win, we're going to execute, but just things didn't fall away and we didn't execute on certain plays and we didn't do what we were supposed to. So yeah. it was just kind of, you know, just to, just the little things like people missing class, like we had to clean up, uh, people being late to things, you know, yada yada yada, mm. being more physical practice, just vocal leaders, all that. So we're 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 gonna keep improving throughout the year. So it's exciting to watch. Yeah, I mean, it looked different out there, and that's why I'm wondering. You've been here about a year and a half. Yeah. If it's something that I guess it probably doesn't happen overnight, and I bet. Yeah. If it got to maybe a little bit of a bad point, yeah. it probably was gradual. Yeah, I mean, coming from, you know, the switch with a team last year with a lot of older guys, you know, Chenna, Seahawk, uh, Sam Darnold, Rojo, you know, guys that have, you know, been there forever, great players. And then, you know, coming into this year with a little bit younger team, yeah. you know, freshman quarterback, you know, obviously still have those leaders, but it was just kind of... You know, we, we lost some important players and just like people filling in those roles, you know, and, and I think it's it's starting to show, you know, young guys making plays like Talano was all over the field. Um, you know, the, um, Amon Ra, like the, the you know, the uh, uh, EA was out there a lot. Yeah. So it's, it's definitely like, you know, just a younger group. So and we're, we're going to we're meshing well and we're, we're going to continue to, you know, the sky's the limit. So I know leadership can't be forced. And so I'm just wondering right yeah. now. Are there vocal leaders on offense, or is that still kind of have to materialize? Yeah, I mean, you know, coming into it, you know, losing, like I said, losing yeah. the key guys, Sam Darnold, Rojo. Um, Deontay. You know, yeah, yeah, Deontay, uh, Stephen Mitchell. Yeah. So, you know, guys have had to step up there, and obviously it's not going to be an overnight, you know, thing. We kind of have to find our identity and, you know, you practice together. So I think uh, this week, you know, there was definitely a more, like, leadership, like, you know, Sed and Vaughns and Pittman, some of the older guys realizing like, this is my time, you know, let's go, so. Final question, uh, how do you transfer you your you level of play to the road? Because the road yeah. is just been different. It, yeah, yeah, yeah. There's no way of sugarcoating yeah. road. Yeah, so, I mean, obviously, you know, playing at home, you don't have to fly, you don't have to, you know, get on a long bus ride. It's, it's, it's a big change, you know, that people don't realize. You like, have a routine. Yeah, yeah, so it's, you know, getting on that plane, Say going to Texas, three-hour flight, sitting in the hotel all night with the time difference. So it's a big, it's a big adjustment. So 
Um, I just think we need to be, you know, just be focused and take our preparation and, and you know, just just execute. Honestly, I think, you know, the past couple of games we just didn't execute yeah. to, to our game plan. So focus, it, are you referring to like during the game or even like the whole preparation leading um, up to the just like yeah, yeah, just like leading up to the game, like, you know, we, we need to do this, like let's execute it when we get on the field type thing. Um, but uh, yeah, I mean, tonight was a great win and yeah. you know, we, we stuck to our game plan. We did what, what we were taught, like the, the field goal, we were practicing that all week and just it's just about executing it, so. Did you feel especially good to win a game running the ball at the end? Yeah, yeah got the that's best awesome. Play. Yeah, you know it was it was cool. Coach Helen just pulled the offense. It was like we're going tight, Thor, and we're gonna we're gonna run these three plays right in a row, and we're gonna get that first down. And we we we're all let's do this, and we got it. So it was, right. the, it was the best feeling. Congrats, Brett. Yeah.